Hello everyone, welcome back. In this video, we are going to discuss on how we can add a custom field in one to many preview of Oro 16. So as you can see here, this is my custom module, the company management. And let me go to the sales module and you can see the sales module here. And if you just create the form view, you can see a one to many tree view. So in this video, I'll show you how to add an additional field in this one to many field of Auto 16. So if you just click on one of the fields here, you can see the field name and the model. So the model of this one to many field is sale.order.line. And now let me just go to the backend. And after going to the backend here, I have developed a PY page for my custom module. And as you can see, I have given a class here that is the sale order line. And I have inherited the model sale.order.line. So if you just copy this and search in the add-ons of the Odoo 16, you will be getting multiple examples. So you can see you can get different examples regarding the same. And let me just go to the PY and here I have just given a custom field. I've given the field name as delivery and the field type as the boolean field. I've also specified the string. So I'll just add the string attribute to this field here. And I've given it as delivery. And let me go to the XML page. So as I have defined the field in the model sale.order.line, I need to give the view in order to see the field in the UI. So as you can see here, I've given the model sale.order.order .order because it is the one to many field. The sale.order.line is the one to many field of sale.order. So I've given the model as sale.order and I've given the reference ID so you can get the external ID from the UI. So I'll just go and show you how to get the external ID of the view. So as you want the field to be inherited in this view, you need to get the external ID of this form view. So after enabling the debugging mode, you can just go to the edit view form and you can easily get the external id from here so you can just copy it from here and paste it in your view in the backend and here i've specified the x path where i need to give my fill in the ui of the form view of sale.order and i have also specified the position so i just want to give this custom field of mine uh, after the name field in the tree view of one to many field of sales. And after giving the code, make sure that you give the XML file in the manifest file of your custom module. And after giving the necessary code, you can just run it from here and make sure you just upgrade the module so I'll just upgrade the module and once I upgrade the module you can already see here that if you go to the sales module and you can see the delivery field is visible here and you can just specify the products here so after specifying the product you can see there is a boolean field here. So as I've given the widget here for this field as boolean toggle. So it is displayed as a boolean toggle in the UI. So this is how you inherit a field in the one to many free view of Odoo 16. That's all for today. Thank you.